more of these <laughs> Starting to like this. What's happening, YouTube? Welcome back to Scout Star MTB. Today I'm on a little solo mission. I've travelled down to Canuck Chase to come and sample some of the trails here. Um, been absolutely lashing it down all last night and pretty much all the way driving here. It was raining all the way. So I'm expecting a lot of water to be on these trails, but to be fair, it's not looking too bad right now. Like it looks like it's draining quite well. So, should be a decent day exploring some new trails at Canna Chase. Anyway, let's check it out. So yeah, here at Canuck Chase, it's the first time I've been here, so no idea where I'm going. Ah oh, yeah, this looks like a start. What, 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 what? You alright? Is the whole trail closed or just that first section, was it? Um, the whole trail was closed, but I've checked the rest of it, so you're okay from here. Thank you. There's nothing down, so... Cheers. I think like the first half of this trail, not this actual trail, but the first bit of this loop to follow the dog loop. It's graded like, it's graded red, but it's like kind of XC, so it's a bit flatter, a little bit more family orientated. But then when you jump onto the other loop, the monkey, that's got a lot more like black options. A bit more gnarlier. Okay, this one's called high voltage. Oh, that was tight. My big ass bike. It's a bit long. Like given the rain we had, well, it was more of a full on torrential storm all last night. And lashing down all the way here. I see the trail's looking pretty dry. Considering. Oh, I'm starting to like this. Whoa, took my eye off the line then. I don't know what you're meant to do with that. Okay, here's the split. So, continue with the dog. Or oh, the monkey, I'm obviously doing the monkey because it's a lot longer, more technical. Otherwise I'd be back in the car park in like two minutes. Just fix that knee pad. The Devil's Staircase. Go ahead, let's try a bit of that. of a staircase, more of some tasty switchbacks. My super long bike doesn't like them though.
get in there. E-bike time. So glad I've got my seal skins. Definitely one of the best things invented, seal skin socks. Oh, there's a first tight one. <laughs> And then on pot of gold. I like this one. Puddle. Okay, now the roller coaster's beginning. Uh, really tight little bit. Be worried if I had wide the bars. Well, I'm kind of worried now, like... Real tight. <laughs> you can see there, people have smacked their bars over the years. That's a lot of bar clippings over the years that's taken. Just goes to show you how wide bars are getting nowadays. Loving the uphill trails nowadays on the e-bike. Makes every part of the trail enjoyable for me now. So I've just been messaged by a guy off Instagram. He's just messaged me saying he knows about a load of off-piece trails at Canuck. And he sent me a little picture of the map of where they are. And it turned out to be exactly where I was at that point in time. Like, so I'm gonna have a little scope of these. I'm here now, like there's one line here, apparently just in front of me over there. There's a line that goes left. That's kind of like a jump line. And then there's a couple more on the right that peel off. It's definitely one here, two there, maybe a third one. So I'm gonna have a little check out of these and see what's what. And uh, hopefully they're running sweet. They look nice and loamy. So yeah, let's check it out. He told me to try the second one on the right first. So let's have a little look down there. Definitely nice and loamy. Big brake bump though. Definitely fun. I like that. I think I'm back up there is the way I'm going. Yeah. Up this mega steep fire road. <laughs> I 
Get a Land Rover to get drive up here. Or an e-bike. This last bit of climb's crazy. It's so loose. Easy to wheel spin. Oh, get the seat down. Lower your weight. Lean forward. Pedal like a weirdo. Correct. Dropping in on another one of these little off piste trails. Lovely and loamy. Oh, line choices. Three different line choices. Let's stick with this one. boss about riding trails blind obviously you can't learn the lines and fly as good as you would if you did know them oh the hell but yeah just something about going down the unknown not knowing what's coming up And now I'm about to drop into the third off piece on the right. There's a jump line just here on the left. Had a little walk down there, it looks pretty decent like. Can you tell me to stay left? Let's try that again. I might stay left. Am I launching off that? Nicely built. That was a decent one. So I think that's me done on the off-piece trails now. Did like what three of them? Still a few more options I could have done, but I better get on with it. tight switchbacks it's my only beef switchbacks are really tight At all. This section's called Snap It. Hopefully, I don't snap anything. Ah, super narrow trees. Low killers. 
this is super fucking tight. See the tree marks then? From where hundreds of people have crashed it going through there. That's probably where Snap It comes from. Snap your bars. Black option to the right. Oh, that's too black. It's like stupidly slow. Oh shit. Just had to commit to that. Didn't have the speed for that one. Ah, oh, should have gone right. My bad. Oh, that one's a wet leg. Puddles. I think even with the seal skins, my legs start to get wet. My shoe's definitely full. Oh my god. Let's have a look at this shoe. So, this is the final, well, I think it might be the final descent. It's called the lower cliff. I think it's definitely one of the longest descents. Out in the open, makes its way all the way down. Oh, it's down there. A lot of piste. Stick to the trail. Oh, tight switchbacks again. Windy out in the open. Those puddles are lovely. Not. The grittiest, squeakiest brakes. Railing the uphills. This one's called Let Loose. Got a black option to peel off. I do hate boardwalks. Well, I've already fell off. <laughs> yeah, I hate them. I'm not even gonna try. They've always been my bugaboo. Oh, real tight. 
Oh, there's a black split off here. Through that. I'm not gonna lie, I thought this trail was gonna end ages ago. stuff I like. Ah, oh, I missed it. Ugh. Too busy thinking about that, just what I didn't do. I just didn't do the rest of it either. trying to do that. Just finished up a ride here at um, Canic Chase. It's my first time being here, so I didn't really know where I was going, but everything was well signposted, to be fair. Uh, follow, the, follow the dog trail out, and then you extend the loop by doing the monkey trail. Uh, yeah, it was pretty good. Uh, even though it was like raining all last night, like super torrential, the trails have drained and held up really well, so ground was decent underfoot. Uh, yeah, I had a message off some guy on Instagram told me like uh, Yeah, you need to check out these off-piece trails and sent me like a little map and like I opened it up read it And it was literally the exact place where I was standing like the next section Just over the other side of the road. There was like a load of little off-piece trails So sessioned a few of them. Uh, I think I did three of them. Some of them had like little offshoots that you could have done And uh, there was another big jump line which I just had a walk down and I didn't get to check out fully but it looked pretty uh, pretty decent yeah it's been a decent day like I definitely recommend coming to this place kind of chases um, it's got a bit of everything like you can bring the kids or you can session some of the sick off-piece stuff and then obviously next door to the place there's um, a place called Style Cop which I don't think I'm gonna get time to have a little check of that out today so I'm gonna have to come back and definitely do another vlog on that because that's like proper downhill stuff and it looks really sick Anyway, if you like what you have seen, smash that like button and hit subscribe. And don't forget to check out the Insta, ScouseStarMTB. Peace.